Benjamin Moore. Corotech Command Waterborne Acrylic Urethane. We've got customers that brought this new paint and I've never sprayed it before and uh, they're like, yeah, just go in and uh, wash it down. Don't even sand it. You can see the gloss level on the original paint and it's going to stick. You know me as a painter, like, yeah, okay, let's try that. That'd be cool if it really does, but I'm going to, I'm going to do a little test sample for you. We're going to do a little pull, tape pull on it just to make sure you're not wasting your money on it. Well. We're getting in here. You can hear that tape was adhered really well. This is scratch resistant paint, waterborne paint. Super nice. It's sticking. Let's paint this trailer. All right. Signing out. I got to get some other windows masked up and. We got to get to spray in our awesome paint that we didn't even have to sand this trailer with. Look at this test sample of this paint we're using. My customer came up to me and said, hey, I got some new paint. They said I don't have to sand it and it'll stick to my trailer. Well, there has not been one trailer that I haven't sanded. And even if I don't sand it on any kind of paint, even if it's sealer or something that actually grabs into a panel, if I don't have it scuffed, you're, it comes off. Well, I told the people, I said, hey, before we go waste your hard earned money on this paint job, I'm gonna lay down a test sample for you just to make sure that we're not gonna have to pressure wash all this paint off go and sand it all down and redo it and start over again so i put this on the night before i just used my dirt wax grease remover wiped it down i rolled some product on about as thick as i'm going to be putting it on here a couple mil stick and i come back this morning i mean what product do you know that will stick to a shiny surface without having to scratch it even says on the can that you have to dull you have to dull your glossed areas well that paint is sticking very well surprisingly i really like the paint you can only get it in satin or gloss you know so there's no metallics or nothing but and as far as whatever paint is on this trailer, I'm sure it's a single stage. I really don't know if you can actually do this with your automotive clear coats. I'd like to try it out though. I want to go grab some and throw it on my car to see if it'll pull off. <laughs> I just don't want to clean the mess up if it actually does stick. So anyways, pretty cool, pretty cool paint super fast if I don't have to sand it. We're just wiping it down and painting it. Quick job. Benjamin Moore, waterborne acrylic urethane command. Man, this paint is the bomb. Look at this. I'm pulling this tape back. This was, you're just still aluminum rails. I'm just pulling the tape right off of this. And the paint staying. I didn't sand anything on this whole trailer. The only recommendation I would put against painting with this is your tape. Do not buy high tack tape. You want to know why? Look at this. This is metal substrate. This tape pulled off factory paint. So. Hey, Benjamin Moore, that's an awesome product. You mask it, you wipe it down, clean it really good, and you paint it. On a trailer like that, like this, man, that stuff is just awesome. We got this trailer painted so damn fast. This is the satin. 
of satin or gloss. Thank you, Benjamin Moore.